I'll take a triple bounty deluxe on a raft, 4x4 animal style. Exchange it with a shimmy, burn it, and make it swim. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to my little outdoor, very organized workshop. Today, we're going to head to the cars and coffee of my little town here. Um, it's up north. As you can see, I've got a stock Predator 212 on this bike. I recently took the uh, Predator 224 I had on there off, and the Predator 224 that I had on here, it's got a Navy 24 millimeter with a pipe. I might do some more upgrades like a flywheel and rod to it, as that might just turn out to be my performance engine. But this one's more fuel efficient as it's not the stroker. I did have the stock clutch on here, but I managed to get the torque converter working again, so it's not so slow.
worry about it. Let's see if we can find some good shit. The van, the good old fashioned boomer mobile. I love this. Oh, an SL Mercedes. That's something my dad would be into. Now, these are very classy. This has also come uh, built to a V6 off-road. Looks like a mutter build. Plenty of rest on that. Pulling a beetle. That's crazy. Probably gets two miles a gallon while doing it. Good old Fox body. Oh, I used to have a Miata. Good old NA Miata. Really freaking love these things. Best manual transmission I've ever driven. Really, really good car. I love these things so much. You know it's American when there are so many land boats here. Got land boats everywhere. Boat. Got another boat down there. A boat. Look at all these boats. It's a boat show, practically speaking. I mean, these cars, especially during the time when a lot of these were made, just so much bigger than every other country making stuff. Yeah, you got the Boxer Twin. Heard of these from Fort 9. R75. BMW. Really pretty bike. You know, you can just walk around here and you can just smell the back in my day. You know how computerized cars are nowadays. I work at AutoZone. I deal with them every day. So many generic iPads with wheels. Oh, this is very similar to the Miata I had. Yeah, same interior, same everything, kind of. This is very similar to the Miata I had. Wonder if it's also a 1992. Just a year I had. Didn't notice this just now, but the Westphalia. Now, I'd live in one of these. I would, as long as I could have a trailer for the bike on the back. Look at the interior, what you got here. You got your, um, looks like you got a water supply here. Probably a little sink in there somewhere. I already guess. Way smaller than my camper, but dang, doesn't it work though? Little, little tiny thing, but it gets way better gas much. My huge ass RV. Little bike rack on the back, pop-up tent, everything. You got the setup here. Oh, these are so cool. They're so badass. I'd be so cozy in one of these. Some people put a lot of effort into old cars, and it's nice to see. Look at those right there. Not as cool as a Mini. 